Hi guys, it's RJ's videos here. Today we got interesting and maybe unusual unbox. So I have these I ordered these little towels from the internet and they're like magic towels. Okay, so I'm gonna just open a resealable bag. <coughs> I'll tip them all out. And there was 50. There's 50 here. There should be 50. I mean, I'm not going to do all of them because I am... I, the main reason I ordered them because we're going camping soon. So, let's get on with the test. Okay, so, to open them, you can simply... It's really simple. You can simply just go like this. You, to open them, you need, oh, can you see that? It says towel on it. To open them, you need some water. So, I've got dish just over there, and we're going to test it out at low angle. So you can see how it expands. But it's really small. And considering I have quite small hands, here it is on my hand. Let's get it started. So I'm going to crack this water open um, and pour a few drops on and watch the reaction. And I could even do a slow mo depending on the speed. Okay, so we'll need some more. And I think that might be it. So I barely did any water, although my pouring skills are a bit poor right now, especially leaning over a non-waterproof camera. Okay, so let's see its transformation. So it's kind of like a wet wipe, baby wipe, or whatever you want to call it. We're gonna, we will do a rip test as well. See the durability. Oh, and you got one more fold. Drops on and. What's the reaction? And I could even do a slow mo depending on the speed. If you can see that, there's uh, these kind of meshes on the towel, and it's amazing that one of these small little tablets has turned into a, a, like a standard flannel sized towel. And it's wet, and you would be able to take these camping because of its kind of usefulness. And You'll be able to fit multiple of these towels in your camping bag. Even in your pocket, you could probably fit all of them in your pocket, depending on your pocket size. If you have one of these large pockets, you definitely would. So we're going to do a rip test now. As you can see, material is not... They're biodegradable, so if you dig a pit, and a sand 
sanitary pit when you're going camping you can easily bury them and it will degrade and in a few years there won't be any signs of any of it left so it's safe for you to do so so but now we're going to do a rip test so firstly we're going to do a test like this folded so if it's if you're screwing it up okay i'll just squeeze some of this water out it's kind of like a sponge okay that's really tough i'm not going to tear it like this because i'm going to see how it tears when it's unfolded unrolled it's a lot it's very sturdy actually Okay, so it turns quite easily, but that's only in a one pressure point. If I had the pressure exerted equally all over it, I don't. I reckon it'd be very resistant. So it's very durable. That does tear, but I don't think it's going to tear if you're wiping your face. Let's say. I, overall, it's very good. It's quite good as a sponge as well. You decide. You, it's a lot more compact than taking it in the toilet roll to the campsite, and that is definite. And it's a lot more durable than toilet paper as well. Please respond where you like it, or do you prefer it out in the open? Uh, so, what do you think? I've got like this set up with lamps lighting up the outside and giving it a nice even look inside i hope you enjoyed this video please don't please if you would like to ring the the bell the notifications bell so this is that's all so thank you for watching thumbs up if you like subscribe bye